Hello, it's Giles again with another two minute tip about champagne. This one is all about how to open a bottle. It's a subject that many people feel apprehensive about, but there's really no need. If you follow the basic rules, it's no problem at all. So let me show you how. When you take a bottle of champagne, the first thing you've got to do is get the foil off. There's usually a little tab and you can just simply unwind that and take it off and put that down and discard it. Then you're left with the wire cage over the cork and a little tab that you fold down. And to release the cage, you need to turn this tab six turns. It's always six turns, that's the way they're made, until it comes loose. Now, some people at that stage take the cage off. It doesn't really matter, it's just a matter of, of preference. I usually take it off. But do remember that there's six bars of pressure inside this bottle. So from the moment you loosen the cage, you need to keep your hand well fixed over the top of the cork in case it shoots out, which it can do, and of course never ever point it at anybody, even in jest. So I'm going to take the cage off and quickly put my thumb back over the top of the bottle. Now the next thing to remember is that when you're opening the bottle, you turn the bottom of the bottle and not the cork. So hold the cork tightly in whichever hand it is, left hand or right hand, and turn the bottom of the bottle. You've got more purchasing power with a wider diameter circle at the bottom than you have at the cork. And also, if you ever turn the cork and it snaps off and you've got a real problem getting it out and you make a, a big mess. So turn the bottle, the bottom of the bottle, and hold the cork. And out comes the cork very softly with a nice little whisper. Now there are two schools of thought about whether you should go for a loud pop and if you're having a party, why not? As long as you shoot the cork up into the air, it's great fun. If you're at a more sophisticated sort of an occasion, a nice, subtle, gentle whisper is what you need to go for. So there you go, your bottle's open, ready to pour, and it's really very simple. Just follow those golden rules, turn the, the bottom of the bottle and not the cork. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed that and you'll find lots more of these two-minute tips on our YouTube channel at My Man in Champagne. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.